get frustrated, you know? And she gets frustrated when she drives. Well, mainly when I drive. Lot. I'm an aggressive driver, so <laughs> move out the way. <laughs> All right, guys, we just got an order from Icon Meals. So excited. And all right, so what do we got here? We got um, oh, brisket sliders. So this is what I ordered. 47 carbs, 8 grams of fat, and 42 protein. So these are like little um, hamburgers with sweet potato fries. Like, how could you not want that? And um, got quesadilla, I quesadilla, order. chicken, bacon, ranch, quesadilla, 34 carb, 22 fat, and 56 grams of protein. So that's what that looks like. There's three quesadillas in there. Um, beefy mac and cheese. Beefy <gasps> mac and cheesy. And that's what that looks like. Beefy mac and cheese. Another beefy mac and cheese. Another beefy mac and cheese. That's it. I just got back from having Starbucks with my client Jess and look what she got me. Like she knows me, like fit girls know each other. And um, so she got me this birthday cake buff bake protein cookie. I never tried it, so I'm super excited to try that. Birthday cake, Lenny and Larry's, like she knows birthday cake's the best. We got birthday cake fit crunch bars. You guys saw us try that in Miami. She got me a gift card to get my hair blown out because she knows that I'm getting my hair blown out. Um, we got Power Crunch bars. We got the one birthday cake bar in a perfect little donut bag. I just love her. You guys know I love her so much. So thank you so much, Jess. You are so awesome. There's Jess in the background. Jess, Jess Hi. over there. Um, she just got home from school, but I'm just feeling like super thankful for you. And uh, I had a great time with Starbucks. We picked out a date. We're gonna do a team dinner. We're gonna do a burger late night team dinner. So we're really excited for that. So we picked out a place. Um, we're trying to get the date finalized, talking about it in the Facebook group. So that was really cool to be able to do that. And we just sat and talked and me and her are just like on a really like the same level. We get each other. So I appreciate you, Jess. Thank you so much. I love everything. And we are gonna get to do some work now, me and Jess and cook up some of them and uh, I'll see you guys in a little bit. Hey guys, good morning and happy Friday. Today is December 2nd. It's actually my cousin's birthday and she's been in London for a month. So she was there for studying for college for this semester. So she'll be home soon, but happy birthday, Alexa. I don't know if you know if you watch anything, but anyways, we're off to go to a viewing this morning, me and my mom. And then we're gonna meet my dad and my grandma for breakfast at the Turning Point, which is just a local place uh, in New Jersey near us. So we're excited to go and I was not excited to go to a viewing, but um, that's what we're doing this morning. So I just want to open up today. I haven't like vlogged in a couple of days because I've been doing like challenge videos and like different stuff for Vlogmas, but happy Friday. All right, so we're just getting to the turning point and we're doing some window shopping right now. She wants to go to Chico's, but it's actually time for breakfast. So it's almost 11 o'clock and uh, there's a lot of music going on right now, but we're just getting to the turning point and I'll show you guys what's going on there. Here, Ma. Ma. Yeah. We're going by it. Hey fam. Always a gone You fool me at the bottom line I lie afraid oh. Alright, so Icon Meal sent uh, protein brownies and they got all the macros on there so it's pretty nice and they're nice and cutely individualized and then the peanut butter power popcorn only one bag because if I have too many bags I'll eat too much of it so 
can't have this temptation around. And then, um, yeah, so always I like having all the brownies. It's so cute. I did the same thing. I actually took my girls to Southwest Philly to go get their jelly. We we, I got waters and waters. <laughs> yeah, Giselle! It was water. Look, can I see Yeah. Yeah. She put a sailor too. Yeah. They got it. Yeah, you gotta see the video. Yeah. She's a vlogger. This is the best. This is the best. She's a convert. Is that yourself? You see yourself? Oh, she will. Who's that? She didn't want to work it. Believe me. I know. Cell phone, he likes the remote control. He don't want the toys. Who's that? Who's that? Say hi, mommy. Who's that? I can't think. Do you like Beauty and the Beast? Nah, sauce. Get your fingers out of there. No. I couldn't believe it. I watched all the way through. I watched all the way through the other day. This is that. It's getting sort of. Like, I don't know if it's only a house with like all the kids and stuff, so it's like you. Yeah. This is frozen, right? Yeah. Yeah. It's awesome. Nah, that's a litter. What is that? Who is that? Uh oh. Here, see ya. Smart. Yeah, we're smart. But she knows we're She knows we're good. Just out. One time she can do it. Yeah, look. Let go. Let go. Let go. Let go. They're buying me anyway. She's taking her score off. She's, 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 she's taking her shoe she off. She's taking her shoe she's off. Her shoe she's taking her shoe off. She's taking her shoe off. Yeah, that's what she did. Now she's watching it. Yeah, she's watching it. I'm having my salad and Jesse's having icon meals. Hi. Beefy mac and cheese. Look at all that cheese, ground beef, and a nice big piece of broccoli because help. <laughs> and uh, we had a great time with the kids. They were so cute, like so cute. It was uh, really, really nice to see them. Uh, they always look at their videos on Facebook, so it's just fun to see them in person. So we're gonna sit down, have lunch, go grocery shopping, and I have to get to my work.
guys, so we just got to the gym here with Jess Jess and we're gonna start off with some front squats. Yeah. Are you excited? She's not excited right now, she's not happy. So, but you're gonna get happy because you get the endorphins going and then you'll be all excited. So, this is today's shape, as you can see here. Just like tracking and staying consistent, so I'm starting to see like more ab definition and feeling really good, so excited to get this workout in on a Saturday. Workout schedule is all mixed up. We're training on a Saturday. So, so, so strange. But uh, let's get into this workout and I hope you guys enjoy it. So I started off today's workout with front squats. I never usually start with front squats. I start with deadlifts or regular squats as far as my heavy lifts. So I wanted to challenge myself with front squats today. But I always warm up with just the bar. I'm just feeling out the movement, making sure I'm getting good form. And I see the video back to see where I need to fix myself in order to hit a good form as I put the weight on. Because with front squats, you can really hurt your neck, you can hurt your back. And it's easy to get injured if you're not doing it right. So definitely warm up with the bar, see how you feel through it and add small amounts of weight as possible when you're first starting off just because you want to prevent injury so I did about 20 reps of this and then I moved into my heavy barbell front squats at this point this is my fourth set I'm now at 105 pounds and I use Jesse as a spotter just to make sure I stay straight and I don't come up crooked and I'm not favoring one leg over the other she just helps keep my alignment and I really appreciate that but as you guys notice I stop at the top for a good two seconds I contract the glutes super hard before I go down in order to maximize the effect with your glutes and hamstrings because I try not to put too much pressure on the quads so I'm really just squeezing super hard and trying to keep good form and I did about six reps of this. I was feeling a bit ambitious so then I decided to move up to 115. I put 225s and 210s on each side again I'm using Jesse as a spotter. Unfortunately I was only able to get three to four reps of this but my reps felt really good. My form was very tight and I'm definitely trying to work up my front squat because my front squat is a lot weaker than my back squat but that's okay it's just something to work on and as you can see I'm just trying to hit different angles of the front squat so you can see how I do this and how I hit my form. There's Jess Jess putting on the 2045, thank you. So we're gonna do. I just did 185 hip thrust, it felt pretty easy for 10 reps, so we're gonna go jump to 225 and then see if we can get above there. After the hip thrust, I then moved into a superset with reverse hack squat, the wide stance. You guys see me do that plenty of times, but then I supersetted with this very close stance, low weight conventional deadlift. I just kept 25s on, I did about 20 reps, and I just contracted the glutes very, very hard at the top, and I didn't overextend the hips at the top, so I just kept the contraction really high. Again, setting my butt back, keeping my chest up. Lifting deeper and in this stance is going to put more pressure on the hamstring so I'm trying to hit a lot of more hamstrings in this movement and then more glutes when I move into the superset with the reverse hack squat. With that movement I'm sort of putting my feet in a diagonal and putting a lot of contraction on the glutes so it's like very glute and hamstring superset focused. Currently dying, nothing less, it's just all the food. There's definitely more food, gives you more fuel, able to push harder, you're having a better workout, so this feeling really good. So for lunch, we're gonna have the spinach fettuccine, and it is 56 grams per serving. And so it's in here, and I'm gonna mix that with the zucchini noodles just to add more volume. So that is the serving with the Victoria tomato basil. And I didn't put a whole serving in there, so there's so much you can have with the tomato basil for only six grams of carbs. And then I'm gonna measure out the cheese and put the cheese with it. This is the full meal. We have the pasta, zucchini, cheese, tomato sauce, asparagus, and some chicken. For lunch, mid, late lunch, I don't know. Having some bacon. And I'm gonna put it on top of the salad I made. So I'm just gonna chop this up and put it right on top. Nice bacon fat in there. So 
I'm so excited for this. Uh, my sister's gonna go to church. I have to get like a lot of work done, so I'm just gonna sit on my laptop, get work done, and enjoy the salad. I can fly. Alright, so basically the whole pizza is gone at this point, but <laughs> I'm gonna have a piece, and my mom had made this pizza this time from Trader Joe's. This crust, I got like an herb one, herb. Mm -hmm. And uh, she just put the gravy on top. We're using the Victoria's gravy, the tomato basil, and just some mozzarella cheese. So I'm excited to try this one. Hopefully, that, did you try it yet? It's good. I'm excited to try it. I'll let you guys know what I think. You guys don't know already, this is protein ice cream with blueberries and a bunch of cereal and sprinkles on top, and that's what I always have for dessert. Nice. <laughs> <I'm> so... <laughs> okay. Right, back to our regular scheduled program. Um, so we were just like sitting there talking, and I like, we were talking about her friends and her dynamic with her friends. I was like, do you guys like ever curse? And she said, no. No. And I never, ever, 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 ever hear Jesse curse. And then, like, I thought about it. I was like, well, I curse all the time. And Jesse was like, well, why do you curse? And I said, well, I curse when I get mad, like, when people can't drive. Because, <laughs> you know, like, it's frustrating. And I get, like, I curse when I get, like, mad and frustrated and stuff like that. And I was like, well, why don't, when you get mad, why don't you say something? So what do you... When I get mad, I just say inside. I don't know. Why, why don't you curse? Because I don't like cursing. It's respectable. I think that's very interesting coming from a family who's like very Italian, very high strung. So like my all my own family does. We don't do it like aggressively. We don't curse towards each other ever. But we just, it just comes out like mm -hmm. naturally. Like when you're frustrated or whatever, that's just something went wrong. Okay. I'm going to you. Like when I can't get my squat up or I can't get my delet out <laughs> up. You get frustrated, you know? And she gets frustrated when she drives. Well, mainly when I drive. Lot. I'm an aggressive driver, so <laughs> move out the way. I mean, she's a passenger driver all the time. She, I hear her curse so many times. She's like, move out of the way, people. Um, yeah, so I just like think it's interesting, like if you do or if you don't, like your reasons are for doing it or for not doing it. Um, how often do you do? I just like sort of wonder, like people's take on it, and how they feel about cursing. Obviously, I don't curse on my channel too much. Like I'll hear here and there, but I never like like curse like at anything or at anybody um it's always just for me when i'm frustrated with myself and just my situation so like that's when i would curse just like sort of was interested in maybe how you guys like live your lives and like how you handle cursing or what you guys think of it just like different topic to the channel and we were just talking about it tonight so mm -hmm. me and jess are polar opposites when it comes to that stuff so mm -hmm. You like never know like who you're living with and how they feel in the house and how you would like handle it. So just want to like sort of add that in. I love you. I love you too. <laughs> All right, guys. So that's gonna wrap up this video. Please give the video a thumbs up. I'm the Uno Champ. Uno Champ. Whoop whoop. Right here. No. Right here. Yes, I am. No. Yeah, I'm in. I'm the Uno Champ. Cause she wants so many night ones, and I have to try to beat her. Because I'm the champ. Good night. Good we night. will see you in the morning for a challenge. You excited? 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 Christmas time. Christmas time. Christmas time. Christmas time. Good night. <laughs>